Well, we are having conjoined twins. We're having two little boys. They are uh, they're joined just like this. They have one body, two legs, two arms, and two heads. Um, they share one perfect heart. However, they have pretty much um, separate other organs. They're doing really good. They're thriving. Right now, they weigh about one pound and 13 ounces a piece. We got a little 19 month old little girl, but uh, we just want everybody to know that how special these babies are and how rare they are. Well, we have to think about like what type of clothes, like will a regular car seat work for them, will it not? Um, you know, how are they gonna learn how to read and write, you know, being together, you know, how are they gonna learn to walk together? Um, it's still a question on who's going to control what. <laughs> Likely one will control one side, the other will control the other side, but it's still that question on how it's going to all work together. Well, babies, right. but babies that look like that. You initially were told of the news, what went through your head? <laughs> well, you know, for like the first 20 seconds, I was, uh, you know, she was devastated for for a little bit, and the first 20 seconds, uh, you know, I, it was hard to chew on for a minute and trying to process it all. But then after that, you know, we just we prayed about it. We've always and, had, and we just said we were gonna take each day and keep going, just go forward with it. Basically. You know. We've always been a little different in our family, you know, with me and my hearing and, you know, and so it just wasn't nothing to us. This is just putting more faith in God that he knows he has a better plan than we do. And we're going to take his plan and just walk every day. I told the ultrasound tech, I said, I'm just going to count it all as joy. I'm not supposed to have any babies at all whatsoever. And I have Sayla and I have these babies. So we just, we're going to take it each day. Um, they're technically due Christmas Day, but the doctor said that I would probably deliver somewhere between 30 and 36 weeks. But um, we went yesterday to the doctor and he bumped me back a week. He said, I don't see why you can't carry to 37 weeks. So uh -huh. that would technically be full term. And that's even longer than most twins. So, so what date would that be? Uh, that would be the first week of December. Wow. So sometime between Thanksgiving and the first week of December. Wow. Then... Like I said, that's the best body shot that we have. We're seeing a, a, a specialist right now that's been in the game for 30 years. He's only handled five cases. And out of the five cases, three of the mothers terminated early. Two of them he went full term with, but they didn't survive. So, yeah. the rarity of these are just unheard of around here. Right. The MRI specialist that took all the photos of her, other than the books and class books she dealt with in college. She's never seen it. She's never seen it. So she was actually overzealous of the um, photo taking. Right. And, uh, but you know, it's just, that's a pretty good side profile of Eli. And, I got a side profile of Asa.